Eric Franke, thanks for being with us. First at 10, Rock County's biggest event is growing stronger. It's nine years in running and bringing benefits to the community. The 19th Brad Jameson tells us how Southern Wisconsin Air Fest is taking flight. Brad. Well, Eric, it was a perfect night for an air show, and the crowd came out to preview this year's Air Fest. Now, two jet teams headlined this, this year's event, which performers say is a testament as to why this has become a premier event. Whether it's the power of jet demonstration teams or the thrill of aerial stunts, an air show brings out the kid in everyone. I have been fortunate now, enough to be a part of each of the air fest shows so far here. Susan Dacey has flown in every southern Wisconsin air fest. She's seen it grow into the premier event it is today. What the Acer show brings to it is a lot of variety. Um, what I think the niche I feel is kind of like the old style aerobatics, kind of the barnstormers of way back when. The weekend is only one of two performances this year where the U.S. Air Force Thunderbirds and Canadian Forces Snowbirds jet demonstration teams will perform at one venue. It says a lot about Janesville and uh, the community and the support they do for the air show as well as their military. So it's great to have people come out, put on two great jet teams. Uh, we have the Thunderbirds as well as the Snowbirds, and we have all the crew that uh, supports both those teams. Everything I've heard from this, uh, this venue has been very positive. People have been in the community have been extremely friendly and, uh, and open to us. So, you know, we just got here yesterday, but it's just been great. The work put into creating the event is repaid throughout the community. 50 to 60,000 people are expected to attend, many from out of town, and all will spend in the community. It's what keeps Daisy coming back year after year. I'm very fortunate to be able to fly the aircraft, and that's what people see. But for every minute I'm flying that aircraft, untold hours and hours are spent, really months, are spent by individuals preparing for this. Now the pilots are just as excited as anyone else for this weekend to finally be here. The weather looks great, and those jet teams are looking to put on an incredible show. And, of course, Brad, the city benefits now from all those visitors, but we understand they hope to benefit later as well, right? A lot of those out-of-towners that are coming to Janesville are coming here for the first time. It's a chance to really showcase the city to people that are potential visitors in the future. And uh, a lot of the people in, around here are hoping that, People that are coming to the air show for the first time will come back to Janesville sometime later. Brad James reporting at our Rock County Bureau. Brad, thank you. And AirFest continues at the Southern Wisconsin Regional Airport in Janesville tomorrow and Sunday. Shows start 1130 in the morning, 6 in the evening. Tickets are $20 at the gate for adults, 10 for kids 6 through 12. Order online in advance. and They're about half price. You can log on to Channel3000.com for more info.